Trey Strange from Carthage, New York, was sent away for 33 years in April of this year for crimes that are new in technique and, at the same time, just about as old as time. He helped a teacher at a private school in Pennsylvania to collect sexually explicit photos from minors, turning our most vulnerable kids into objects and victims. In this case, there were more than 200 minors affected. And it was not Strange's first time through the courts on similar offenses. When he was a minor himself, he had gone through court-mandated sex offender treatment for offenses he committed then. Andrew Wolf was a teacher at the Springside Chestnut Hill Academy in Philadelphia. He worked with kids and exploited them and would be sentenced in March 2023 to almost 39 years in prison. The pair were coercing young boys into sending them photographs between May 2020 and October 2021, at least, they impersonated minor girls to entice their male victims into sending the explicit photos. Strange sent more than 27,000 messages and 4,000 images over social media. Once he got one photo, he would often use that to blackmail the boys into sending more. He targeted boys at Wolf's work. Wolf would target boys and provide identifying information, which he had access to as a teacher. And he also targeted boys well beyond the walls of that school. Wolf was caught and arrested before Strange. Did that stop him? Did he realize the jig was soon to be up and stop? No. He continued to exploit, blackmail, and extort kids. He will have to register as a sex offender and cannot have electronic devices that aren't approved by a probation officer. He will have to pay restitution to his victims as well from whatever funds he earns in prison. But that's not the end of this story. Strange and Wolf demonstrate clearly how important it is that we talk to our kids about safety online. Their entire worlds are lived online nowadays, and we need to equip them with the tools to navigate that world safely. Thankfully, there are a lot of places to go for information and a lot of good folks out there to help with technology that is rapidly changing and information that, frankly, can be challenging to, just to keep up with. To start with, uh, there are some websites their links will be below if you're watching this on YouTube. Otherwise, Google is just a few keystrokes away. Uh, four of the centers you might want to look at are the Google Safety Center. The uh, Consumer Reports provides uh, tips on keeping kids safe online, as does the Federal Trade Commission in the United States and Protect Kids Online in Canada. Thank you so much for listening and until next Thursday. If you're enjoying these videos and want more, don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications so that you don't miss any videos. Thank you for watching. We really appreciate it.